Hey folks, welcome all come back to another Pump Massive video, and today we're going to try out uh, both the Subway Bros on the same team against Mr. Reggie Rock over here, right? So, we're going to have to do Reggie Rock because there's no rock or steel or ground weak master modes, unfortunately. And I'd say Ingo's not the best with Legendary Arenas just because, you know, he is slightly suspect on setting up Sandstorm because it's only MPR2, unfortunately. But I mean, Hopefully we'll still be able to pull, pull through, right? Uh, Rage Rock's probably one of the harder Legendary Arenas, I guess. Probably the hardest. Even though it's still not, like, super hard, but, like... Because Legendary Arenas overall aren't, like, super difficult. But... Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll see how it goes, we'll see how it goes. So, uh, the really, really nice thing about running uh, Excadrill with these two is because... Like, these two are really, really hard to run. Uh, with each other because first of all Draldon is incredibly slow. This guy's like terribly slow, right? And yeah, four gauge move over here that you want to use and then on the flip side uh, Archaeops, which is much much faster. You do also have a four gauge move due to uh, To do whatever it's called again. Oh, yeah hit the gas five, right? And the great thing about Excadrill over here, right? Is that uh, you give them uh, the whole team free move next effect in Sandstorm so if you, if you use that like once per sync cycle, that could take a really, really hefty load off of your team overall in terms of their, 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 um, you know, the, the, the move gauge, right? So that's really, really nice. Uh, but yeah, anyways, let's do this. Draldon also a big, you know, sand grid over here, sands of time, certain sand three, sand blaster, sand shelter, all that stuff. And Archaeops over here, I mean, uh... I do have sand sink just just so we can get an extra um, you know sand uh, uh, sandstorm out there. Although I might be regretting this stone edge thing because I think I might want to use honestly now that I think about it I might want to use like rock slide more just because it's Reggie Rock and <laughs> Lynch is really really good against him <laughs> right. So I think rock slide might be better. But oh well, I, maybe I could just like you know rock slide and then once they're flinched I could. Go Stone Edge or whatever. Also, they share, you know, three theme skills with each other, which is also, in my opinion, pretty cool. <laughs> All right, let's get right on track. I'm gonna use a Dire Hit Plus here because uh, we need one more Crip Buff to get ourselves maxed out. Because I don't want to use the second All Aboard, right? Just trying to, you know, avoid using that uh, if we can. All right, let's get that in. Let's get. <laughs> All aboard, steel beam. That's a free steel beam, right? So, oh wow, Red Rock actually takes a decent amount of damage from Sandstorm. <laughs> We're slightly ironic because, like, he is, you know, because you usually find him like in like deserts and stuff, right? His um place, and also obviously he's literally made of rocks. <laughs> his name is Reggie Rock. He has rock in his name. All right, folks. <laughs> but yeah, he's doing. Dece really a decent amount of damage from this sandstorm. No, that's almost like a thousand damage each tick. What the heck? <laughs> Anyways, can we get a flinch? The answer is no, it seems. All right, that's fine. Let's go ahead and sink here. And I think we should have enough gauges after this sinks. Oh, because there's an extra stomp animation, right? We should be able to get, yeah, four gauges back. So we're not gonna sans or not sandstorm. Um, uh, not sandstorm. Uh, the trainer move just yet, right? Whatever the trainer move is called. All aboard? I don't know, something like that. Probably has something. Um, uh, whatever. Well, I can't remember what I was about to say. Oh come on, we didn't crit either. All right. So we got sand sink, sandstorms back up. And shrug off, whatever. I mean, we're not here to lower its accuracy. <laughs> Just pass turns, one gauge move and all. A flinch here would be pretty clutch, honestly, because that's gonna stop. Oh, there we go. Because that's gonna stop them from from putting up the crit shield, which is, in my opinion, I'd say pretty, pretty, pretty key, right? <laughs> having crit shield, not having crit shield, big, big difference in terms of our damage output against them. All right. So let me see if I queue up one more rock slide. That would probably guarantee us. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that's GG. I, I think we're gonna take them out before they could. Uh, they could set up a crit shield here then. 
assume our moves hit because I mean the accuracy on these moves slightly suspect. All right, <laughs> let's uh. Do I have actually buffs actually? Actually, never mind. Yeah, yeah, I have, to, I have plus two accuracy. All right, yeah, I have plus two accuracy. Forgot about that. We're, we're good, I think. All right, this rock slide from them is gonna hurt. Uh, we'll just have to see how much it hurts, I guess. All right, I'll have a potion here ready. Wow, that hurt a lot. Okay. All right, we're definitely gonna be healing Drowled on over there. So, uh, so, uh, uh, our traps have tanked that one, right? Because with the, the, the train move, the, the guard thing. So that's nice because we are above 50% HP, which would still trigger the extra 50% uh, damage multiplier for us, which is, again, very, very, very nice, I'd say. So let's get another Steel Beam in. Can we get another flinch in, please? We are out of Sandstorm, so that's not very good. Oh, we did get a flinch, which is very, very, very good. However, all right, let's all aboard here. I mean, I'm going to use it before the like, Sandstorm goes away anyways, right? Cause or else it won't work. <laughs> Sandstorm's gone, so I just gotta like use it here. Even if we, even if it, even though it seems like we don't really need it at the moment, but again, I'm just gonna use it anyways. All right, hopefully we get like one more steel beam in before the um, for before the before the sandstorm goes away. Not sure if we can or not. Can I queue up the steel beam here, man? The answer is not. We're gonna get hit by a rock slide first, sadly. Can we get a flinch though? No. Okay. Guaranteed crit rock slide again. Not very fun, I'd say. Yeah, unfortunately, couldn't get one in. Oh well. That's gonna be slightly problematic for a multitude of reasons. Uh, first one being we have to we have to potion Archeops for the damage output. First one being we're not gonna do as much damage here. <laughs> Second one being. Um, uh, Excadrill is not going to tank nearly as well either and third issue being uh, move gauges we you know that takes away a lot of um, move gauge acceleration as you could see Excadrill does not tank super super well without Sandstorm over there okay all right Raihan sync over here Was that actually the sync move name? I've never noticed. Is actually Steel Cloud? What was Steel? <laughs> or, or did I, did I see wrong? Because I'm pretty sure that's what I saw. Steel Cloud, Steel Beam, or something like that. All right. Uh, who's the next person tank? I think it's Draldon, right? Yeah. Well, at least I hope it's Draldon. It's gonna be terrible if it's Archeops, because that's gonna, again, just decrease our damage even further. Yeah, Steel Beam's not doing enough damage outside of Sandstorm. I mean, it's, it's not bad, but like, I wish it would do more. <laughs> crit, crit next. Yikes. That's not very good. Oh, no, it is Archeops. No, 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 rock slide, rock slide. Please flinch, no. Okay, at least it's like a rock smash, which is not like a huge deal. But, <laughs> or damage wise. But I mean, I think it's still gonna take us out because like, our defense is not very good. Yeah, yeah. Oh, well. Oh man, we're so close. Come on. Unless we get two of these in before they sink. No! Man. If only if only we got one MP refresh on Sandstorm. And if only we got one MP refresh on Sandstorm. <laughs> oh well. That was slightly sad. Really? 2%? Okay. You know what? All right. If you're gonna disrespect us like that, okay. We're gonna go ahead and throw in the worst <laughs> legendary event Pokemon. By the way, Sogaleo, man. Oh my God! Did this guy get shafted? Like when I was like, you know, before Mewtwo's Grid like came out, I was like, okay, maybe, you know, maybe Mewtwo's Grid might also not be like that great or whatever, and like, you know, maybe Sogaleo might not be shafted that bad. Maybe there's still a bit of hope for him not being the worst legendary uh, event unit in the game. No, this guy got absolutely destroyed. <laughs> Mewtwo's Grid is fantastic. All the other grids are fantastic. Even like the second worst legendary um, event Pokemon, which is 
either a Kiram or Rayquaza is miles, miles better than this guy. It's like, like they're, like they're, like Palkia, Xerneas, Rayquaza, Ho Oh, Mewtwo, uh, Kiram, they're in like, they're in, on a level together. And then Sogaleo was like, <laughs> gee, this guy got shafted so hard, man. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Well, anyways, let's move this one, I guess. Um, unfortunately, we uh, we completely wasted seven energy over here. Pink up sounds around here. We're going to get, get one. But, yeah, uh, again, works really, really well. Um, I really do like the, the, the gauge flexibility that uh, Excadrill gives, right? Um, it's especially when we have more sandstorms. Uh, which, honestly... Man, if I knew I was gonna get any sense from MP first, obviously that's ridiculous because, you know, hindsight and all that stuff, right? I would have just picked up MP first on the trade move. <laughs> would have had, you know, instead of that one dark hit I used with uh, Ar uh, uh, Archaeops to like past turn, I could have just, you know, used that trade move again, got another free move there, and then just used a rock side, which would have KO'd Ready Rock. <laughs> <laughs> but oh well, it is what it is, I guess. So, anyways, uh, that's where we this one. I guess hope you guys enjoyed. Let me guys think in the comments down below. Like and subscribe to our channel for some more Pokemon Mouse's content. I'll see you guys in the next one.